Hello, this is Deborah Darris with your productivity tip of the day. Now there is one device that I absolutely cannot live without. It is my handy dandy timer. And is you ever watch the soap opera Days of Our Lives? Remember how the sands in the hourglass go down? Well, in order for us to be productive, we need to create self-imposed deadlines. And we, when we have eight hours or 10 hours or 12 hours of day to complete a task, oftentimes we'll meander, we'll go to the coffee machine, we'll do little things that get us off track. However, when you schedule yourself to work in 10, 20, 60, I like 90 minute increments, and then you stop and go on to the next task, you will have a sense of urgency. I'll give you a concrete example of this. I was riding the Metrolink because I want to save time that I'm wasting driving. I could be doing so much. The value of my two hours is definitely worth the $12.50 to take the train. And so I said, I'm going to accomplish this task. This was a task I had been procrastinating for about two weeks. But because I had this focused time where I was on the train, I got the whole project completed. So you could do the same thing without having to get on the train, although I do recommend the train, is by using a timer. This is a Polder timer. I got it on Amazon.com for about 12 bucks. You can get any sort of kitchen timer. I just like this because it has the sands of the hourglass and it's kind of fun. Everything I do has to be fun. So I suggest this. If you want to be productive and achieve your most important goals each and every day, use a timer. This is Deborah Darris, productivity expert, inspirational speaker, and author of Confessions of an Adrenaline Addict with your tip of the day. For more tips and tools, strategies, and seminars, go to www.debradaris.com.